Hey guys, welcome back for another video with Fiat Destroyer. Today I am finally revealing the um, the contents of this package here that we have from MK Bars, and I apologize for the length of days in between my um, giveaway post and this um, unboxing. Life just gets really busy sometimes, but I, I do try. And anyway, apologies out of the way. Here again is the prize, this 1 10th Walking Liberty round, which was won by none other than Silver Damsel. So congrats to Silver Damsel for guessing the correct answers to the questions. So yes, once again, as I explained in the giveaway, this package here contains a few channel bars that have been discontinued from MK Bars. And this is my March MK Bars unboxing. So let's go ahead and open this up, take a look at what we got. All right, so first off we have some COAs. And bars are gonna be deep in the belly. There we go, hope we got them all there. All right, so the the answers to win the giveaway was um, Lake House Beach and Silver Bean Counter. Those were two channel bars that I did not have in the collection. And then I also picked up two others that I already had. I just wanted to have a second one. So here we go. First one there is going to be from Lake House Beach. And let's just go ahead and open up all of these. So if you don't know what these are, oh, this must be the silver bean counter. Awesome, because that's the only square one I have. If you don't know anything about these, these are put out by MK Bars, which is a, um, a company that makes poured silver art of all sorts of different things. They have a really nice website. You can check them out. In fact, I may even put their website in the description if I remember. And I made it a sort of goal of mine to make a purchase from them every month this year. It doesn't have to be a big purchase, but I got started with um, picking up some limited edition Eagle Bars along with these channel bars. So these here channel bars are members of the community that are featured on MK Bars, or were, and they're, they were available for a mintage of up to 200. So um, on my COAs, I should have the, the numbers that I got. And I guess they just, uh, yeah, became discontinued. Actually, this one has the number right here. This Lake House Beach one. Let's bring this in nice and close. Uh, let's see here. There we go. So you can see I got number 34. And I'm not sure what the final mintage is, but it's probably not too much higher than 34. So that seems like a pretty low number out of 200. And the actual mintage is going to be probably significantly lower than, than 200, I'm guessing. But Lake House Beach, um, we don't see him that active here on YouTube, but he is very active on Instagram. And he makes some really, really cool... Um, poured silver rounds and bars and such like a lot of a lot of uh hammering and toning and stuff that goes into that so anyway yeah also just a really cool logo too um that is just uh really awesome i really really like that so so this is the the channel bar for that and these are all one ounce exactly or maybe a little bit over but they're one ounce rounds or bars and then here we got Spectacular, the Silver Stacular, a fairly well-known channel. So we can get this to focus better. Um, he's got a ton of subscribers, makes a lot of really awesome and interesting content. Especially popular are his interviews with a local coin shop that you can go and see. Now I don't know if this one actually has the serial number on it. I may have to go and look on the COA but but also a really really nice logo there and of course um, we all know this guy Silent of Age Metal one of the founding fathers of the silver stacking YouTube community so 
yeah that's just really cool how they got that nice font in there and am i seeing what is that say? is that a 90 it can't be 96 i can't remember if that's the the serial number there or not but i'll check the coa here in a moment and then this one's new so as i said this is the only whoops dropped <laughs> it actually went down on my sleeve um this is the only square one i have and it looks like every side says silver bean counter up there and he actually has some other um channel bars that you can get but i love how this one looks on the edges and i love the coffee beans too i'm a huge fan of coffee i drink lots of coffee every single day thankfully i have i have access to good coffee for cheap because of my situation so i'm thankful for that and then i could do a comparison here of the the two reverses because they're kind of a little bit different there pretty nice so anyway silver bean counter um, definitely go subscribe to his channel if you have not done so already. He makes a lot of um, interesting content. He brings a little bit of a different perspective than what you get on some of the other channels around here. So that's pretty cool. And he likes to buy vintage silver bars. So you'll learn a lot by watching his channel um, about different things. You'll learn a lot from watching all the different channels because everybody's got their own specialty. So there we go, four ounces of poured silver for the stack. I had to edit out some information, but here we've got the COAs here now. So for silver bean counter, <laughs> I wrote collector, it's funny. I've got number 55. And that just says the series mintage is 200. So I don't know what the final number is, that, but I would like to, to find that out. And these all look the same I think on that side and then for salivate metal number 96 so that's really cool that was a 96 that I saw right here All right, if you can see that it's really t filled in with toning so it's hard to tell but there's a 9 and a 6 right there so wow less than less than 100 I'll have to go back and check and see what my other one is so 96 for solid metal, and then number 115 for spectacular, so that's definitely a little higher. Um, LA Cost Beach number 43. So that, I think, is the lowest. Yeah. So it's kind of surprising that these were not more popular, but it is what it is. The series is over now, so pretty, uh, not that many of these out there, <laughs> really. And... Talk about getting a very limited mintage for not that bad of a premium, really. Um, pretty cool. Pretty sweet little guys. I I considered like just going crazy with these and getting a whole pile, but I, I wasn't sure. So I am glad I got what I got. And now I can add these to my poor silver treasure chest. So that's awesome. But anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. I do look forward to engaging with you in the comments down below. Let me know what you think about these channel bars. And as always, I hope you're having an awesome day. Keep on stacking and keep on destroying that fiat.